All right, what up everyone? Zona right here for a new vlog. Uh, as you know guys, I moved to LA and I'll tell you why in another video, hopefully very soon. But I thought I'd just record my journey today and basically today I uh, went to my storage room when I moved in here. I, I, I was jumping Airbnbs, etc. It was so frustrating. So I had to put all my stuff that I accumulated, like my, we got my PC here, nice and safe. My little monitor as passenger and we have like some luggage and some shit back there uh, so i'm gonna go home now i recently bought a desk that i want to talk to you about that is amazing muy bonito and yeah we'll talk about this uh once i get home i'll see you then so i just got my stuff in my room right now uh, i will just uh, set up everything and to, to put my computer back together and all and i'll catch you when it's done peace <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna unpack my computer. I have the genius idea of using my boosted board. The plan is to put the tower or the desktop on the boosted board and control it with the remote. Yeah, I hope, uh, I'm hope i not gonna fail that shit. Let's get it. This is how you do it. All right, let's get this thing in the elevator. But look at this thing, look at this thing. Oh, I gotta go in reverse. There we go. Okay, so I need to come on. Get in. Oh no. Okay, we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Oh no no, don't leave it on me. Alright. Let's do it. I didn't want to do this uh, in my apartment with a boosted board. The wheels are disgusting and I have a carpet. So desktop is here. The boosted board goes here. And my monitor. So if you guys don't know, I have a boosted board. Uh, it is expensive, but right now, uh, one of the good advice I would give you is if you want a boosted board and you're thinking about buying one for like the summer, which is a perfect item for summertime, uh, buy the version one. On, if you're not, if you're under a budget, buy a version one on Craigslist or eBay. The version, the version one is fine. It works amazing. It's fast. Uh, I still use it, and I have like, I think I have like over three thousand miles on it, which is pretty good. Uh, what else? Yeah, don't if you don't want to. I would rather you buy an old, even used uh, V1 boosted board than a Chinese version or like a cheaper version. Like boosted board is a very good brand and the quality really, really holds even through the miles. And the customer service is top notch. Uh, I know the new models are 1500 and not everyone can afford that. As far as my computer is concerned, this little bad boy, I've had it for... Now uh, I had this Bible for like three, three years, three and a half, like four, even four years, I want to say. Uh, I made so many videos, so many uh, streams of it. I really hope it held because the drive was kind of bumpy uh, and it was just in a storage box for a long time. So I've never done this before. I'm going to rewire everything and see how it works. I pray to the gaming gods that it will work. Let's get it set up. Oh my god, I can't find my mouse. Alright guys, little update. Uh, I'm gonna Best Buy, I'm gonna buy you the mouse. Uh, I really searched everywhere, like on every single suitcase. I just couldn't find it, so I'm gonna check out Best Buy. Hopefully they have some Logitech or some Razer stuff that I could buy. Uh, yeah, the thing is with mouse is that I'm really used to one mouse and I really have to try it, so I can't really buy it on Amazon. Uh, but yeah, let's go. Let's see. Uh, let's see what it is.
this is so cool. It's funny because when I grew up, there was nothing gaming when you went to stores like that. There was maybe like one mouse or like one keyboard. Now look at this. You got Razer, you got Logitech, you got Corsair. You have a bunch of other stuff as well. Turtle Beach, sponsors of Optic Gaming. You have Fnatic, Fnatic Gear, HyperX. Pretty much everything, everything in the industry is here. That's so cool. Uh, I actually bought the mouse. I went to Best Buy because I really wanted to try uh, if the computer works. It actually works, so I'm super happy that it didn't get damaged in the car or anything. Um, I don't have internet yet. I might have to fix that in the next few days. I might have to buy a modem or something, but I bought a mouse called the Logitech G502. I wanted to talk to you about it. Uh, it's actually a mouse that I, I've i tried. So I was a user of the Razer Ouroboros for, since my 18th birthday. Uh, shout out to my brother who gave me this mouth. Uh, for my birthday so it's been four years now four years and a half that i use this mouth the same one like i didn't buy another one such a cool product uh i'm usually loyal to brands like i wanted to go back for razor um but i tried this mouse and my uh this mouse in the atlanta cafe and i thought it was a very good one so if i can get this thing open i'm, I'm just gonna go casey and i start on this thing just like this thing. maybe in a few months or a few weeks i can give you an actual review why? Why did they put the fucking wire like that? One of the reasons why this mouse is so peculiar is that uh, you can control the weight inside. So there's like some... I think there's a way you can control the weight. I'm not... So here, here we go. I think this is something that comes with it. Uh, with the branding, Logitech Gaming. Um, and there we go. So you get to control the weight with those little... Those little thing here. So... They come one, two, three, four, five. So you have five little things like this. I'm just gonna show the camera. And each are 3.6 grams, so they're like literally nothing, but in the mouse, it can make the difference. And I'm not sure where they So you just lift this thing up. Here, like, you lift it, and then you can put, I'm gonna try a heavy one. I like, I like heavy stuff. Huh? So here's what the mouse looks like. Very cool design, very nice material, very nice grip here. This is super important because I usually go like this on my mouse. Like I, I go like this, I have a tick. And the, the mouse wheel is like, you have a free mode. I don't know if you can hear this, but it just goes. Or you can press this button here. Or, what button? Oh yeah, but you need to plug, I think you need to plug it, but once you press this button, it will just be a more like, regular mouse pad, um, uh, uh, mouse wheel so i bought this thing for 15 dollars that i think everyone should buy it is the steel series um qck so which is their brand of uh mouse pad but this is the xxl so it is an actual like table like it will take the whole table the re two reasons why i love it is that one it allows you to keep your keyboard, or your desk clean. It allows you to have your keyboard and your mouse at the same level. And it's just a free range. Like it, it feels like it's the table. It feels like you're playing on the table. Whereas like when you have a small uh, mouse pad, you're like kind of restricted to play in like a certain area and you'll go like this with the mouse. Like you'll lift it up, lift it up. I liked going all around like that. I'm sorry about the nose outside. But to be honest, SteelSeries uh, is the best brand for um, gaming mouse pad 100 100 i absolutely love it i think they do such an amazing job uh it is the right thickness the the way it's soft on the mouth i just i just enjoy it i know razor Corsair, all those companies are making but i still buy only still series when it comes to mouse pad because they just make the best ones out there oh it smells horrible it smells like uh, a new tennis ball so So here's the setup guys, so you have the big, big mat, very nice, I honestly love it. It goes all the way here, 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 and you have my new Logitech mouth. So I have a Razer keyboard, a Logitech, uh, and a Steel Series on the same desk. Uh, my headset is also uh, Logitech, but it's okay, I don't, it's okay, it's okay to have a few brands. So I'm going to use my thing to just lift it up a little bit. 
and I'm gonna fix my computer. Uh, let's get started. So, so yeah, that was a little video about my setup. Uh, if you have any questions about what I have on my desktop or whatever, feel free to ask in the comment down below. Um, I will soon make a video about my desk, which I think is super, super interesting. Like I tweeted about how standing desks are making a difference. Uh, I want to think of a cool video to make about about it, just to show you how cool this thing can be. So thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you for the next one. Cheers.